Well the ball is actually a little short of the one yard line now it is fourth down the final play unless they can stick it in the end zone. Andre Johnson Roscoe Parrish and Kellen Winslow and Dorsey under pressure throws it incomplete the Buckeyes win. C. Grant was the man who pressured Dorsey and now the party begins for the Ohio State Buckeyes. They are 14 and The way it has been with me, especially after the announcement last week that I have won. I couldn't believe it. I'm not sure now that I do. Levels five yard line. The big thing, Brent, is don't turn it over if you're throwing the football. Keller is offset from Pepe. Jermaine gonna throw it wide open. Got him, but guys lead it. 19 seconds to go. And the freshman, David Boston, with his second touchdown pass of the game. Oh, he used, just used a little press move. He came off the line of scrimmage, Brent, moved to the inside, reverse pivot, and pushed to the outside through the strike touchdown. Very well done. Wow. College football. No better game. Be proud of our young people in the classroom, in the community, and most especially in 310 days in Ann Arbor, Michigan on the football field. Trips to the far side. Here it is. Navarre to the air. Deep. Intercepted. Ohio State pulls off the upset. The Big Ten champ, Michigan, a heartbreaker at home. ABC Sports is online at ESPN.com. Keyword ABC Sports. Stay tuned. Skins game up next. This is ABC Sports continuing the tradition of excellence. Goodbye, everybody. Snaps it on two. Game over. Ohio State will play for a national championship. The Buckeyes beat their arch rival again. Such a tight game. In your mind, what helped number one emerge over number two? Well, yeah, those are two great football teams. And our team has got a lot of belief in one another. They love one another. They got a lot of humility. And they just keep playing. Now that you've played this team, what are your thoughts on a rematch in the national championship game? We're going to enjoy today the Ohio State-Michigan game and the Big Ten championship. Thank you. Your neighbors, enjoy this celebration, but keep it peaceful. Yes. Have a good time. Show some class. Exactly. Show some class. I think the couple things were determined here at the end. The end of this game, Ohio State off to the national championship game in Glendale, and I think Troy Smith secured the Heisman Trophy in New York City in a few weeks. I think one other thing, Jim Trestle is a great football coach. That was an outstanding game plan tonight. I believe he took Michigan by surprise with the four and five wide receiver looks, and they didn't recover until halftime. Nothing but respect for what Jim Trussell has accomplished here in Columbus, Ohio. And you watched him here again today. 503 yards of offense against a team that was stifling opponents all season long. 
So that will wrap it up here for Bob and Kirk and me from Columbus again 42 39 bucks win it and a big reminder now California USC coming up in less than an hour 8 Eastern time and also stay tuned now for the thrifty car rental postgame report after this from our ABC stations. Michigan, Ohio State. After a century plus, the stars align, and America came to Columbus. How great was this? Young athletes admired. Legends remembered. A hard lesson learned. An historic victory earned. Only in America, only today, until the next time the stars align. I think this team will be the preseason choice to win the Pac-10, and they could well wind up. Well, they're certainly going to be in the top ten. Next. Totally agree. Totally agree. And with Masoli coming back and James, much like Ohio State, most of that that nucleus is he not over yet. He won't let him do it. Him. Oh no! <laughs> you remember what Chip said before this game? Coach Trussell gets yeah, it. Absolutely. streak to the SEC in bowl games by Ohio State is one play away from being over. So with only one blemish on their record this year it's going to stay that way. The Buckeyes will end up 12 and 1. And let the celebration in New Orleans begin for Ohio State. Another BCS win for Jim Trestle. A heck of an All-State Sugar Bowl. Well done by both teams. Finally got to Coach Tressel. They were searching him out for a long time over there on the sideline. Let's check in with Holly. Well, Coach, they were slow on the Gatorade, but they weren't slow getting this game started. How did the momentum you picked up in that first half with the, both the big passing plays and the running plays help you? You know, we played a great team. Arkansas is a great football team, and our kids fought and fought. We had so many injuries on defense. And, you know, I couldn't be proud of these seniors. They're unbelievable. We lose a coach, Daryl Hazel, the head coach now at Kent State, and we lose some great people. We've got a lot of lessons to learn, but our kids fought like crazy tonight. Michigan's at the door. That's a mismatch way in the favor of Ohio State, and Boza made him pay for it. Drove Lynch right back into Christian Hackenberg. Joey Boza coming into the game, leading the Big Ten in tackles for loss and sacks. And we told you about four hours ago he was one of our impact players. There's the impact on Lynch, and Lynch will feel that for a while. 
And so will Hackenberg. By Urban Meyer. Here's the handoff, Samuel. Touchdown. Jacardin's ready. And they're getting ready for the Gatorade shower for Coach Meyer. Watch out. All right. <laughs> That's what they brought him here for. To win championships. To win championships. And fourth down and ten. Stavi dancing in the pocket. Stavi in trouble. Stavi drops it out. Clement. And Clement. Picks up the first down, but the clock runs out. And that's it. The final score from Indianapolis. Ohio State 59, Wisconsin nothing. Urban Meyer wins his first Big Ten championship game as a head coach of Ohio State. 59 to nothing. We've got a lot more to come right after this. Ezekiel Elliott, and he's got an opening. Elliott, off to the races. Can they catch him? No, they can't. Touchdown. Feels it, it immediately spins free. Baylor Marshall showing the versatility. Fires downfield. Devin Smith is open and makes the catch at the five. Elliott. Dots the eye of this national championship win. Cause you're a sky, cause you're a sky full of stars. And the Ohio State Buckeyes are the first national champions of the playoff era. series that we've seen him fit. Barry looks, fires, touchdown Buckeyes! Marcus Ball, J.T. Barrett! Spectacular quarterback, J.T. 
JT Barrett, the final score from Columbus, 39-38. The minutes remaining on the clock. They played clean, Joe. They did. They had to, and they did. Their defense was spectacular. I'll let you enjoy this in a sec, but you completed 16 passes in a row, three touchdowns in the fourth quarter. You put this team on your back. How did you do it? Now, I mean, I just did my job. That's what they talked about all year, and even since I've been here, everybody do their job. We're going to be winners, so I just did my job and just tried to play my best for the team. There was emotion on the sideline. I saw some tears from some of your teammates. Tell me about the fight you saw from your guys tonight. Yeah, I mean, it didn't look good early. I mean, let's be honest. So with that, you just kept on fighting, and then it took everybody's last ounce to get this win, and um, I love those guys in that locker room. Does it get any better than this? Say again? Does it get any better than this moment? Hey, this Buckeye Nation has fine. Big Ten football. Buckeyes win 39-38. Go Bucks. All right, enjoy. Thank you. All right. Guys. Penn State led by 18 points twice in this game. Ohio State led once at the end. 39-38 the final. Rob Stone and the guys will be live from the shoe with more post-game coverage right after this. Now the game is on the line. Fourth and 20 for the Badgers at their own 47 with a minute 16 to play. Chance for ball game here. Buckeyes can come up with a play. The Badgers dream of an undefeated season in danger. Hornibrook gets the snap. Drop back at his 37. Hornibrook fires middle of the field. And it's intercepted by Ohio State. Buckeyes will did it. They did it, man. They had a big play there on fourth and 20. How about KG Bear? Huh? How about KG Bear? Oh, what a warrior that kid is. Buckeyes just had to take a knee here. Wisconsin, no timeout left. The sidelines will come together as Ohio State will win a Big Ten championship tonight in Indianapolis, defeating Wisconsin. You did it, man! You did it, bro! You did it, across his body high and the catch is made and Benjamin Victor is still running Victor cutting back against the grain heading for the end zone and will make it in Ohio State still alive again slot receiver uncovered there it is and they pitch it to Hill Hill first down still running touchdown Ohio State Buckeyes have the lead Ball game right here. Just get it off. Sanders, smothered. Chase Young, another big play. Ohio State makes a stop and takes over. And they're going to come to the whiteout and conquer the Nittany Lions. Urban, what did you say to your quarterback who had been knocked off schedule and really knocked into an uncharacteristic performance having to drive 96 yards to win the game? It was 96 yards against a hell of a defense, too. Great environment. Uh, all respect our, our uh, opponent, but uh, wow. Uh, ben Victor making that great play. Defense making stands against a great quarterback. That's a great team win. 
You said we had gone wrong. Nothing went right A to Z, you told me on the way in, in, in at half. What did you tell the team? What adjustments did you make, Urban? Well, Ryan Day and Kevin did a great job, and Greg, you know, Greg Shano. Just great coaches, great players, found a way to win against a good team. What does it mean to you to come into this environment, get a win like this? That's one of the best wins I've ever been a part of. Dwayne, the first thing you said when you walked over here was that was unbelievable. Why do you say that? You know, we were down and out. We had a really hard game. We played all four quarters really hard. You know, we believed in each other, though. That's what, that's what's so amazing about it. We came back. We were down, never, never lost faith. You know, it was just amazing. Mm -hmm. Take me back to less than three minutes on the clock, and you orchestrate a 96-yard yeah, drive uh, to take the lead. What was your mentality going into that drive? You know, just one play at a time. You know, people get caught up into the end game of the score. You know, ever since that drive started, we we're just going to manage the game. We're going to go out there and try to do the best we can and go score a touchdown. And our defense played a great game today. So many people had questions about you, first-year starter, and coming into this raucous crowd. What do you think you answered about your ability to handle a field environment like this? I've been doing this since I was a little kid. You know, God's had his hands on me, and, uh, you know, I was made for this. And what do you take away from this win with Ohio State? It's a great win, really great momentum shifter for going into next week, the homecoming versus Indiana. You know, I'm just so proud of my boys, so proud of my defense. You know, we're going to enjoy this win. Six straight times, Michigan has lost to Ohio State. Is this the day that changed? Well, I think that the biggest difference the past uh, games has been the quarterback play. JT Barrett has just really been an outstanding quarterback for Ohio State. That's been the difference. Now Michigan has Shea Patterson, a dual threat quarterback. Obviously, Don Brown's defense, one of the tops in the nation. They say that revenge is a dish better served cold. It is freezing out here. <laughs> I think Michigan will pull off the victory today in Ohio Stadium against the Buckeyes. Good thing. So is the question, who are you for, or who do you think will win? Yes. In your case, both. Well, I'm for Ohio State. Make oh. that incredibly clear that I'm obviously sure. a former Ohio State captain. I am pulling for the Buckeyes with all my heart. Also, my job to be objective and fair. This Ohio State team has had some issues on the defensive side all year. The offensive line has had problems. I think the emotions here will keep Ohio State in the game. I think they'll play their best game. But I really respect this Michigan team, the leadership that they have. And because of that, I think Michigan with Shea Patterson will find a way to win the game. All right, Michigan is walking in. Besides us, here's Chase Winovich. Bryce, who you got? I mean, I got the same problem with Herbie over here. I mean, I, I think Michigan's an unbelievable team. You know, Shea Patterson, I think he's going to come out and have a great game. I don't think Ohio State has played a quarterback in the last couple of years against Michigan um, that is going to come out and do what he's going to do. But my wife would kick me out of the house. <laughs> So I'm a dead man. There is no way I can do that. I mean, I hope Jay, uh, Dwayne Haskins, DK Robbins, KJ Hill, I hope they come out and have a great game. Um, so I got to go to Ohio State. So uh, Ohio State, hopefully, hopefully by a field goal yeah. or more. Yeah. Yeah. So. That's a real good pick. Ohio State is an underdog to Michigan for the first time in a long, long time. It's obvious Michigan is playing better than Ohio State. It's obvious what Brutus is meant to be for 23 years. Yeah. Today, sweetheart, strictly business. Give me that helmet. Oh, oh. He put the... <laughs> <laughs>J. Hill back deep to await it here in the third quarter. Stapp goes back shoulder high to heart pressure coming. Punt block. It's fluttering around and it's picked up and grabbed and running down the left sideline and into the end zone for an Ohio State yes. touchdown. Unbelievable. A game like this is hard enough to win. This came at the really wrong time. Throws and the ball is intercepted. Right now, Michigan fans all around America are throwing things in their family rooms. Can't tell you how many people told me this is the best Michigan team I've ever seen. Michigan and Alabama are the two top teams in the country. 40 to 19 is what I gotta say. Fly sweep, Paris Campbell, right side, 35 to his own 40. Out the sideline to the Michigan 40. Campbell to the 30. Campbell to the 10, and he takes it to the house. This third quarter has been a complete total disaster for the Wolverines. Haskins with a shotgun. Back to pass, Haskins looks, fires, right corner of the end zone. 
Campbell's got it for the touchdown. Paris Campbell on a 16-yard touchdown pass. That should take care of it as Ohio State wins the Big Ten East Championship. They'll go to Indianapolis to play for the conference title as the Buckeyes get their seventh straight win over Michigan, 62 to 39. Take some shots down the field if they can get some pass protection. Eskins gets the snap. Straight back to pass. Touchdown, Chris Olave. 29-yard scoring catch from Dwayne Haskins. And they're able to stem some of the momentum that Northwestern had. Let's see if they can hold on to their 10-point lead. Haskins back to throw from his 15. Haskins will send that one long downfield. Johnny Dixon got it to the 25 in Northwestern. Now Dwayne Haskins has over 400 yards passing again. Hum ho. Yeah, something he's made a regular thing. <laughs> Snap to Dwayne Haskins. Back to throw. Looking. Steps through the pocket. Now weaves his way out to the right. Haskins running at the 10. Goes back middle of the field. Caught by Dixon. Wide open. Touchdown. And it is now a 38 to 24 Ohio State lead over Northwestern. Haskins in the shotgun. He's going to try another pass. He's going to throw on the run to the end zone. Dobbs has got it for the score. His fifth TD pass of the night. Man, I enjoy watching Dwayne Haskins throw that football. He's carved up Northwestern. How about that, man? How about that? Oh, they got him with the Gatorade shower. Speaking of the head coach. That probably feels awful good to him right now. And that's going to do it. <laughs> Ohio State wins their 37th Big Ten Championship, defeating Northwestern 45-24. to Yes! Tonight's Big Ten Championship game MVP, number seven, Dwayne Haskins. three or four yeah. kickers on some random field that are practicing onside kicks. This is where you hope it pays off. Now he goes the other way, tries for the big hop, but Johnny Dixon is there to collect it at the 49-yard line. And with 42 seconds to go, that's going to do it for Ohio State. They will win their eighth Rose Bowl, headset in the air from Urban Meyer, and he will go out a winner and cap a career at Ohio State in which he won more than 90% of his games. What will be your lasting memory, not only from this game, but from your time at Ohio State? Well, our, our mission, when we said back in, I believe it was 2011, we want to make the great state of Ohio proud. We want to make this great university proud. And I am so proud of our players. We've had a great run, and I appreciate Buckeye Nation for being there the whole time. Urban, congratulations. Well done. Urban Meyer. In seven fields, looking back side. In the corner, touchdown, K.J. Hill over the shoulder.
shoulder, 24 yards. What a throw by Fields. You talk about dropping it over the shoulder. Check out KJ. He goes inside to get outside, creates separation. There's the speed for Hill. And just an absolute perfect pass from Justin Fields. Oh. Hassan Haskins, he'll run it for the one yard. Can he get there? No! Ohio State's defense turns him away. And the Wolverines turn it over on downs. Devon Hamilton and Malik Harrison combining on the tackle. Justin Fields with time. Fields dancing. Fields delivers near side caught. Found a tight end, Luke Farrell. Fields underneath. Austin Mack, burst of speed, touchdown, Buckeyes. Mack is back. Three for Michigan. Patterson. And incomplete, broken up. Amir Reek reached around, knocked it away for the second time. More than just a little partner. J.K. Dobbins first down, of course. What a day, what a life, Dobbins. First down, Dobbins. Dives, touchdown, Ohio State. A career high, four rushing touchdowns. Field, Shea Patterson. Knocked away and intercepted Amir Reap. He's got blockers. And Reap goes down at the 50. Hawkins remaining. And the final play of the game. Ohio State will win it. 56 to 27. The Buckeyes have now won eight in a row against the Wolverines. 15 of the last 16. Ohio State with 577 yards of total offense. The combination of J.K. Dobbins and Fields, eight touchdowns combined. 14, gets the snap, rolls to his left field to the Wisconsin 20. Takes the pass, Fields still with the ball, fires into the end zone, caught by Hill for the touchdown! And this game has turned around in the second half. For Wisconsin, you see if you can you know, somehow bust some big play to get it in there as soon as they can, if they can. Fourth and two, Wisconsin at the Ohio State 32. And that will wrap it up. Ohio State comes from behind to win their 38th Big Ten Championship. Coach Ryan Day. We played tough, gritty. We played all three phases. I think we deserve to be number one.